Cane Rocks Through the Ages is a history of concerts that were held here starting from the 1960s all the way up to today. The main plan for this exhibit was to hang it in the Kruger's Den. It's composed of original ticket stubs from the 70s, 80s, and A tracks records. It features artists such as Fleetwood Mac, Peter Frampton, and then getting into the 2000s with Kanye West who was here. When Frank decided to do the exhibit, we talked about what could be in the archives, and he went through every single newspaper, and then he did, repeated the process with the yearbooks and compiled everything and then framed everything. What inspired me to put this exhibit together was when I was discussing with my supervisor, Erin Algendor. She told me that Jerry Garcia performed here on campus. Coming from a rock and roll background, I was looking for who else. The reason why it's important to Kane University, it shows that diversity factor of the campus changing. We are so diverse, we want to try to get music from all different areas of the world. It also is a great history, and a great history for New Jersey and Kane University. There's a big rock and roll history here that not a lot of people know about. This exhibit is really cool because it shows off Kane's rich history in rock and roll with musicians that I didn't even know performed here. And the fact that one student put all of this together is ridiculously cool. Music is something that most people can relate to and it's timeless. So you've got something that the students, faculty, and staff, regardless of how old they are, are going to look at and, and feel something. We hope to have it be a permanent exhibit in the Kruger's Den. And once I graduate, I want somebody who has the same passion to add to this. I wanted to keep going 30 years to see just who else is lucky enough to play on such a great campus here.